Hi guys, my name's Phil and today I'll be taking you through a strength EMOM, so a strength workout today. So EMOM, what it means is every minute on the minute. So we're gonna be setting everything off for a 60 second timer to complete a certain amount of reps in that time. I'll explain it more when we get to the exercise. First, I'll go through what we're actually going to be using today. Today, I've got a bag with a bit of weight in it, so a brick or anything you can use at home. If you don't have a bag or if you've just got a brick or a bit of weight, you can pop that wherever we use our bag today. I've also got two bricks. So if you've got some dumbbells or any sort of plates, weights, anything like that, you can use two of these. Try and get them the same size. I have a band, so I've just found this band that I've got laying around. I'm gonna be using that today. And I've got a bench. So if you're gonna be using the bench, you could use it as a couch, anything like that that you've got laying around that's kind of a bit elevated off the ground. All right, so now that I've gone through what we're using, let's get into a warm up. Our first thing we're gonna do is some arm swing. So we're coming 10 forward, so really round circles coming over the top, really opening up those shoulders. Make sure you don't lose count and 10 back. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. From there, we're going to go into some toe taps. So, I'm going to be face this way for you. We're going to come down to our toes, feeling the stretch in the hammies, keeping our back as straight as you can, legs as straight as you can. We're going to come up onto our toes, reaching up for the sky, coming down. We're doing ten in total of these. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. From here, we're gonna go into some squats. So, toes are shoulder width apart, or they're just pointing outward, so our legs are shoulder width apart. We're gonna be sitting back, so pushing our hips back into our heels, coming as low as you can, parallel with the ground, if not and standing all the way back up into our heels. We're doing 10 of these, making sure knees come out, but we don't want them going over our toes. Keeping the chest up. And 10. From there, we're gonna go into some lunges, so standing up still. Feet are shoulder width apart. Chest up, I'm gonna take a giant step back. We're gonna do five on each leg. I'm bending both knees 90 degrees, making sure that the knee doesn't go over the toes. Coming down as low as you can. Let's do 10 in total. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, if you need balance. Hands on the hips or hands out in front. Awesome, from there, let's come down onto our hands and our toes or on your knees if you'd like. Arms are shoulder width apart, a little bit wider. We're gonna do 10 push-ups. So if you're on your toes, elbows come back, coming down as low as you can. If you're on your knees, try and take your feet off the ground tuck the hips in and 10 reps like that. Elbows coming back into an arrow shape. You don't want them flaring out too much. Let's go for seven more. Awesome. Then from here, last exercise, let's get that heart rate up. We're gonna start with some burpee sprawls. So, Hands and toes, you're gonna jump in, jump up, jump out, jump in. Give me eight more, 10 in total. Three, four, five, standing up nice and tall, six, nice and fast, seven, eight, nine. If you don't wanna jump, you can just stand up. 
10. Awesome job, guys. So, grab a drink, catch your breath back. I know I need to. Alrighty, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go through the first four exercises. It's an EMOM, so like I said at the start, 60 seconds for every minute on the minute. You have to complete 15 reps of each of these four exercises. So your first minute is gonna be a brick deadlift. So you're gonna grab your two bricks or your two plates, dumbbells, whatever you have, and you're gonna be standing up nice and tall. I'll show you side view. Chest up, shoulder blades rolled back and down. I'm gonna roll the bricks down my leg, just like we did in the warm-up for your toe taps. Coming just past the knees, feel the stretch in the hammies, nice straight back, chest up, squeezing back up through the heels. So the arms stay straight. We don't wanna be bending them up. Over and down. Over and down. Okay, nice straight back with that one. Your second exercise is a glute bridge. So, I'm gonna grab my bag for the second part, or your plate, your weight, whatever you only have. It's fine to use what you have. You're gonna be laying on your back, knees up to the sky, toes pointing outwards. You want them quite close into your glutes. Bag rests just on the hips, just above the legs. We're gonna push our glutes up to the sky Big squeeze in the glutes at the top, hold for a second, and coming straight back down. Pushing your shoulder blades into the ground, coming up as high as you can there. Third exercise, brick flies, or dumbbell, plate, whatever you have. You're gonna be laying on your bench, your couch, whatever you have about. Start with the bricks closed together like this. You're going to bring your arms out nice and wide like a big hug. Slight bend in the elbows, just coming a little bit lower than your chest and then squeezing back up over the mid chest and repeating. Really try and squeeze your forearms together. I know that they won't come together, but if you get that extra bit of squeeze, it's just a lot benef more benefit for you. Okay, coming over and squeezing there. Last exercise is a banded row. You're going to grab your band, or you can use your bricks, your plates, your dumbbells for this one as well. I'm gonna stand on my band. Alrighty, I'm gonna shorten the little handles so that I don't have too much to use, so it's a little bit harder for me. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring this in, squeezing my shoulder blades together, and coming back up. So your position is just like your deadlift, slight bend in the knees, coming over the body. Make sure these are nice and tight squeezing the shoulder blades in here at the same time. 15 in total for each exercise. Four whole rounds, so we're going for 12 minutes. Nope, we're going for three rounds. So we're going for three rounds, ending up for 12 minutes. So 10 seconds on the timer, starting off with your brick or plate dumbbell deadlift. Grabbing your two weights, two, one, let's go. Chest up, sliding the bricks down. Big squeeze to the glutes, standing straight back up. Almost there, keep squeezing, nice straight back, engage that core. Awesome job. You're gonna go into your second exercise now. So your glute bridge. Five seconds on the clock, 15 reps here. Let's go. Squeezing at the top, 15 in total. Take your time.
Almost there, keep squeezing, feel the burn. Awesome job, keep it going. If you're not done yet, grab a drink, have a little quicker rest. Grab your weights, your two weights. We're gonna go into our brick flies, 15 reps. Let's get started, third minute. Big squeeze at the top. Take your time, almost there. Awesome job. Keep it up if you're still going. Going into our fourth exercise, your banded row. Time has started, so let's jump straight into it. Big squeeze at the top. Breathing through it. Engage that core. Awesome job, that's one round done, two to go. So. Back to your first exercise, your brick deadlift or your weighted deadlift. Time has started, let's go. It's creeping up on us. Nice straight back. Almost there. Big squeeze. Nice control. Awesome job. Into your second exercise, glute bridge. Let's go. Fifteen reps. Big squeeze at the top. Hold for a second at the top and release. Almost there. Big squeeze. Awesome job. Onto your third exercise. Now grab your weights again. Weighted flies. Two, one, let's go. Big squeeze at the top, big stretch out, slight bend in your elbows.
Make sure the weights are coming over your mid chest. Keep it up, almost there. Awesome job. Fourth exercise, banded rows. Good. Make sure the back is nice and straight. Slight bend in your knees. Tuck that core in. Elbows in. Nice big squeeze. Awesome job. One more round to go. Starting with your brick deadlift. Three, two, one, let's go. Keeping the arms out straight, sliding down your legs. Nice straight back, chest up, shoulders rolled back. Keep it going. Awesome job. Second exercise. Getting back down on the ground. Last time you're here for your glute bridges. Let's go. <sighs> Breathe through it. Almost there. Good job, guys. Keep it up. 10 seconds, getting ready for your third exercise. Grab your weights. Brick flies in three, two, one, let's go. Big squeeze at the top. Keep moving. Almost there. Awesome job, guys. Last exercise, last minute for this EMOM. Grab your band or grab your weights. Set yourself up into your starting position. Let's go. Good, keep it up. Make sure those elbows are tucked in. Nice straight back. Keep it moving. We're almost done.
Awesome job, guys. You've got about 10 seconds left to finish that off. Then I'll explain our next few exercises. Grab a drink, have a little bit of a rest, shake it out. Alrighty, so the next bit is gonna be another EMOM, 12 minutes, but it's only three exercises this time. So four rounds. First one up is a, you're gonna need your weights, your bricks, two weights. You can do this standing or you can do it seated. I want you to do it seated, if not, you're gonna be standing, legs out, nice straight back. We're gonna be pressing up above our head, coming down, okay? About ear height, pushing all the way up. You can choose to do this on your bench as well if you wanna do it seated, just like so. Okay, from there, you can use one brick behind the head, elbows tucked in, a tricep over the head extension, coming all the way up to the sky, elbows tucked in, reaching for our back, up, up, up. Okay, nice straight back, core switched on here. We don't wanna be flopping this around everywhere. And your third exercise, your last one, is gonna be biceps curls. But this time we're gonna do a little thing with that. We're gonna be seated, just like our press. We're gonna be coming up, holding for a second, and releasing back down, okay? Nice straight back with our seated curls. Core switched on. Alrighty. Grab a quick drink if you need to. Have a little bit of a rest, shake it out. Three exercises, four whole rounds, so each minute. You're gonna do 15 reps on each exercise. We're going to be going very soon. Starting off with your seated press. Ooh, careful there. So you can choose to do this on the floor, standing, or on your bench if you do have one. 10 seconds. Starting position above the head. Pushing the elbows out. Two, one, let's go. Coming down to ear height. Good job, keep going. From here, I'm just gonna turn over to my side just to show you what it's gonna be looking like in another angle. Nice straight back, core switched on. Fifteen in total. Take your time. Awesome. Keep it going if you're still going. Placing one weight on the ground. Grabbing your weight, tricep over the head extension. So your starting position is above the head. Three, two, one. Let's bring it down. Coming all the way up and all the way down. Just show you on the other side as well. Coming down, elbows tucked in, all the way up. Fifteen in total, feel the burn. Awesome job guys, keep it going. On to your third exercise now. Seated bicep curl. So you're gonna need your two weights coming onto the edge of the seat. I'll show you on this angle as well. Weights down by the side, chest up, nice straight back. Let's go. 15 in total. Elbows tucked in, try not to rock too much. Big squeeze at the top. Awesome job guys, keep it up. 
you're still going. If not, shake it out. Quick drink if you need to. Back to our brick seated press. Grab your weights, your dumbbells, your plates. Let's go for our second round. 10, two, one, let's go. <laughs> Keep it up. Nice straight back. Make sure you engage that core in all these exercises. Good job, guys. Keep it up. Almost there. Well done. Placing one of your weights on the ground. Shake it out, grab a quick drink. 10 seconds to set yourself up for your second exercise, your tricep over the head extension. And let's go. 15 in total. This one burns. Keep the elbows tucked in. Hug your ears together. Almost there. Breathe through it. Awesome job, guys. Keep it moving. Right to the end. Complete all your reps. Set yourself up for your third exercise. Bicep curls, two, one, let's go. Elbows tucked in, chest up, shoulders rolled back. Fifteen reps in total. Almost there, keep pushing. Awesome job guys, keep it up. We're almost done. On to our third round, two more rounds to go. Seated press. Five seconds on the clock, three. Two, one, let's begin. Good, keep that chest up. Nice straight back, core engaged. Pushing all the way above the head. Coming down to ear height. Almost there, keep pushing. Awesome, placing one on the ground, setting yourself up for your second exercise. Tricep over the head extension. Three, two, one, let's go. Tuck those elbows in. Breathe through it, I know it's hurting. Fifteen in total. Awesome. 
shake it out if you need to, grab a drink if you need to. It's nice and quick, it's creeping up on us. Third exercise for our third round, bicep curls. Two, one, let's go. Really focus on keeping the elbows tucked in, chest up, shoulders rolled back. Try not to lose count. Awesome job, guys. One more round to go, Three last three exercises. We got this. Starting with our press. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's make this our best round. Try and stick with all the reps, try not to break. Keep that core engaged. Keep pushing. Awesome. Grab your plate, your dumbbell, brick, whatever you're using. Last one. Tricep over the head extension. Three, two, one, let's go. Almost there, keep it up, feel the burn. Elbows tucked in, keep them as close as you can. Awesome, keep moving guys, we're almost done. One more exercise to go. Last one for your final round, for your final EMOM. Five seconds, seated, curls, two, one, let's go, 15 in total, try not to swing, Almost there. Keep pushing through the burn. Almost done. Chest up. Awesome job, guys. You've got about 15 seconds to complete it. Keep moving. You're almost done. Good job, guys. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and you are done. Well done today, guys. That was an awesome workout. Make sure you cool down and stretch afterwards. Thanks.